Learning communication skills to help your friends and partners in their times of need is such an important life skill to have to strengthen those relationships. Today, I want to talk to you about another skill that I like to call, it's not about you. <laughs> when someone confides in you, it can be helpful to offer parallels from your past. Okay? For example, if they fear failing a course, recounting your own close call can provide empathy or reassurance that they too will overcome. Yet, it's vital to distinguish between empathizing and redirecting attention to yourself, okay? While it's fine to convey understanding of heartbreak, it's not beneficial to dwell on your past or gloat about your current state, okay? Be careful of the bigger fish approach or one-upping in a conversation, stemming from fishermen one-upping each other's catches in the conversation. While, while this might be playful among friends, dismissing a friend's concern or a partner's concern with my issues or worse isn't supportive and can be damaging. Okay? Avoid over-exaggerating their dilemma or appearing clueless about its resolution, which might amplify their anxiety. Regardless of your personal feelings, their concerns should remain central. In essence, it's not about you. Share personal tales, ensuring they uplift and always refocus back on them. Let your emotions remain in the background, maintaining their issue as the focal point.